Hi guys, I hope you're all keeping well. Just a little garden talk today. It's quite um, a nice day over here in the north of the UK. The sky is clear. Nice blue skies, quite windy. And I just thought I would pop into the garden like a little know my arm and just check on you all. I've been thinking about as we ascend that we need to protect our auras. I talk about this every day with clients. And sometimes when we ascend, we become more sensitive to the negativity what's out there. And I want you to comment on the link below what you believe on this, because a lot of people are coming to me and they're saying, Louise, I'm feeling it at the moment. I feel like I'm really getting affected when I go out, even when I go to the shops, when I just when I'm going out and doing my daily business, I feel that I'm really getting affected by people's energy. Are you going through that? There's many different ways how you can protect your um, aura, your energy field. And one of them is using crystals. Now, I normally use tiger's eye, amethyst, um, but it's what suits you. And remember that your energy is changing all the time because we are frequency, we are energy. So there's no point me saying, oh, get tiger's eye because it might not affect you. you you might be better off with some amethyst so it's about trial and error okay but if you feel like you've had a really bad day say in the office or you've been really affected by people's energy have a salt bath it works wonders it really really does and it just cleanses your aura there is a, a saying that i'm going to give you today and it'll really help you and I always say this saying when I'm going out, you don't have to say it out loud. You can say it in your head. You can whisper it. And it really, really works. And what I say is, I invoke Archangel Michael. I invoke Archangel Michael. I invoke Archangel Michael. Please protect me from anyone's negativity. Keep me safe. Bring me back safe, happy, well. So be it. With love and light, love and light, love and light. And nine times out of ten, you will come back feeling great. Okay? So angels are there. Archangel Michael is the warrior angel. Don't feel guilty to ask for protection from him with all the bad stuffs going on in the world. Because he's, he's not human. Remember that. So he can be at any one place at any one time. That's what they're there for. But they'll only come and help you if you ask for help. Okay. There is a lot of information out there where people will say, oh, you've got a demand for help. But I just believe in being polite. Um, not wishy-washy, but definitely polite. And I always speak to people the way I like to be spoken to. And it's the same with angels. You know, they have feelings too. So comment on the link below and try it out. It really, really works. But... If you feel when you're out and about, this also works as well, and you feel like you're getting affected by someone's negative energy, say, for example, you're standing in a queue in a shop or in a supermarket and someone's making you feel uncomfortable. Okay, you can try this with anybody who's, you know, being abusive or anything, you know. you What you do is you just imagine you're putting a shield around your aura. Okay, try this out. And it can have mirrors on and you can imagine that you reflect in the mirror and pushing them back. And if you do it correctly, right, this works every time. If you do this correctly, you'll find that that person will step back. Try it out and have fun. Remember, the angels are here and they are waiting. They are just around the corner they are there, they are, they'll, they'll walk with you, but you have to ask for that help. Be strong, stay safe, and may the force be with you all. <laughs> Take care now. Bye now.